Hi, SBC attendees. I'm Jeff Dugid with RLF, and I'm joined here today with Carolyn from the Army Corps of Engineers Fort Worth District and Jason Powell from EML. And we're here to talk about the best practices today for setting up your match networking sessions. Carolyn and Jason have went through their profiles and determined that they're excellent matches for each other. They both have NAICS codes that the other is looking for. And so we're gonna talk and find out how they're going to conduct their match networking session. Jason, can you tell us how you're preparing for this session? Absolutely. Uh, well, first of all, um, obviously went to uh, the agency website and I looked up and downloaded all the forecasts uh, that the upcoming opportunities they have and selected a few that I would like to talk about. Also, uh, in the virtual booth, there's lots of information. I was able to go in there and um, glean a lot of information from there and wanted to make sure that I was most prepared uh, for my time with Carolyn. And Carolyn, what is one of the, what's one thing that you want to know when you meet with Jason? What it, how can he best come prepared to your meeting? Well, <laughs> Jason's already done a lot of his homework. He's already looked at the agency booth, which is perfect. He always looked at the forecast and he has an idea of pretty much what he's interested in it, doing business with the Army Corps of Engineers. But what I would like to really know about Jason that uh, he doesn't know, but I'd like to know what it is that his firm has that no other firm can bring to the table. Excellent. So we all know the importance of being punctual at SBC. These meetings are gonna last 10 minutes and you only have 10 minutes, so it's important to show up on time, not waste anybody's time, and end the meeting after 10 minutes, respecting that there are appointments following. Jason, do you have any tips for us on other things that you should not do in this networking session? Yeah, I don't think this is an opportunity to ask questions about uh, betasam.gov or any of the other um, software programs or how they get uh, information out there. It's really to focus on the opportunity and how we can best fill their uh, need. Excellent, because Carolyn did not develop beta.sam.gov. Carolyn, what's one thing that you don't want to, to have happen during this networking time to waste time? That you don't have the correct next code. If you sell office products and we do construction, it's not really a good match. You know, I just want you to basically see something that, you're, that your firm can actually do. And if you don't match up with the next code, how you can get matched up. Excellent. Thank you, Carolyn and Jason. Together, they've had 10 minutes of networking time. They've gone into the session prepared, and hopefully they're prepared now to, to win lots of work together. <laughs>